Welcome back, Sethling here. I noticed some really weird behavior with dispensers in version 1.0. So for, for example, if I flick this switch, I get this auto turret that's shooting five arrows per second, which is pretty cool. It's nice and compact, but the weird thing is that this clock is controlling the speed of this turret without actually being hooked up to it. You'll notice it's just a one clock here, but it's not actually hooked up to the dispenser. And it's, uh, so it's kind of weird behavior. This isn't really how dispensers are supposed to work, I think. And if I flick the switch off, it'll stop the turret. So here's what's going on. If you put down a dispenser, oh yeah, arrows. All right, if you put down a dispenser, and let me put some arrows in it. Now, when I power the dispenser, it shoots an arrow. Um, the weird thing though, and the kind of the weird behavior is if I put some redstone over here, even though this redstone isn't powered or anything, um, it causes the dispenser to shoot again. And so if I add one here and then I add another one here, we're noticing some weird behavior. Even though it's not even attached, it's causing the, uh, it's causing the dispenser to, to shoot an arrow. So what's going on is essentially that anytime the dispenser gets a redstone update, it's firing because, because it's powered. And so there's a variety of situations under which you can get a redstone update, but having redstone change configuration or, or get placed or, or removed nearby will cause it. So it's kind of interesting. I think it's a bug, but in the meantime, it allows for this, uh, this super cool auto turret design right here that looks really awesome. So that's about it. Thanks for watching.